ఉంటాయి హాయ్ గైస్ వెల్కమ్ టు పీసీఎఫ్ సో ఇన్ దిస్ క్లాస్ ఓకే ఇన్ దిస్ క్లాస్ సో వి ఆర్ ఇంట్రడ్యూసింగ్ ద ఓకే వి ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కస్ అబౌట్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు యూనో క్రియేట్ ఎ వీడియో ఆన్ సిక్వల్ సర్వర్ అనాలసిస్ సర్వీస్ ఓకే ఇన్ సిక్వల్ సర్వర్ అనాలసిస్ సర్వీస్ వీ హ్యావ్ టూ మోడల్స్ యాక్చువల్లీ వన్ ఈస్ మల్టీ డైమెన్షనల్ మోడల్ అండ్ అనదర్ వన్ ఈస్ ద టాబ్లర్ మోడల్ సో వీ ఆర్ మోర్ ఫోకసింగ్ అబౌట్ ద టాబ్లర్ మోడల్ నౌ so even microsoft also recommending the tableau model now okay so like when to choose what okay what is multi dimensional model and what is tableau model so we are going to discuss about the what is tableau model and when it is introduced means okay it's introduced in 2012 as a new feature for analysis service okay so like um, tableau model means you know so whatever the you know uh, features are there in the multi dimensional so they have modified something some features and they removed some features and they added some new features okay so from a multi dimensional model only tableau model came so but some advanced features and then some existing features removed from the multi dimensional model and some advanced feature added okay so that is about the tableau model so what are the new features added what are the existing features removed we will discuss in this uh, video uh, from Uh, practical we will see from uh, tomorrow day after tomorrow okay so now we we'll see the difference between um, multi dimensional model and tableau model guys okay multi dimensional model tableau model okay multi dimensional model so it will show store the data into xml file okay but tableau model so it's a x x velocity analysis engine actually it load the data into x velocity analysis engine it will have the what effects engine okay what effects engine means it will compress the data okay what effects engine will compress the lots of data okay if if it is compressed one by third size okay if multi dimensional compress one by third size but tabular model will compress one by 10th uh, size okay that much uh, data it will compress so how it will compress what is what effects means we'll discuss tomorrow so what is what effect and how it will compress and all we'll discuss tomorrow but so tableau model compared to multi dimensional model tableau model will compress more data okay and so and also uh, multi dimensional will connect only relational database but uh, uh, tableau model can connect more sources so that may be excel source super source oracle db any sources it can connect and also why we will compressing and then why we are why we are connecting means for fast retrieval okay data uh to retrieve data fast uh, so for uh, no so our ultimate goal is to analyze data fastly for that purpose we'll go with the tableau model and uh, in multi dimensional model we have a cell level security but uh, in tableau model we have a row level security or object level security we have and then we are using uh, uh, you know dax here uh, sorry mdx here means okay multi dimensional uh, expression here so here we have a dax data analysis expression okay we'll use this one to calculate the major and all and when to use tableau model okay when we have a less amount of data we'll go with the tableau model when you want to use uh, this tableau model in a pivot or uh, pivot table okay uh, power pivot or power view or excel uh, share point something like that then you will go with the uh, tableau model and for more sources okay if you want to connect more sources we'll go with that and then just now i said right so like so when we have a you know fast retrieval data like more speed on queries then we'll go with the tableau model then why we'll go when we'll go with the multi dimensional model means so when we when we are data when we have large data like terabytes of data so more data then we'll go with the you know multi dimensional and write back option okay when you want a write back write back means what so you will give the capable Uh, edit capability to the user okay whatever user will change that will write back to the database okay so write back means from uh, user can user will have the capability to change something the data that will stored in the database okay that means that write back option that write back option is not there in the tableau model but uh, we have in the uh, multi dimensional model and when we have a complex calculations and a complex model then we will go for the multi dimensional It, this is only for the relational database okay so when we have a proper uh, um, you know uh, clean data and relational database 
then only we'll go with the multi dimension and then common points between the you know uh, multi dimension uh, and uh, tableau model so we have a you know uh, we have a calculated measures we have and drill through we have hierarchies we will discuss okay what is this calculated measures and drill through and hierarchies kpis okay so right back option we don't have and a many to many relationship okay we have that but we have to avoid that and role playing so and actions we don't have that in the tableau model okay so that is the main difference okay what are the common points and uh, um, lesson 2 what we will discuss okay what is x velocity and then what is what if act injur so how, how it will work and all we will see with examples okay how the data will be compressed and how the data will be stored in the database and all we will discuss tomorrow but for now uh, in this end of the session you will understand like what is the tableau model what are the new features is added so how the data is compressed and uh, where uh, when to use and all okay so you in this uh, video you will understand when to go for the tableau model and when to go for the multi dimensional model okay so here we have seen the main feature is what if act engine so what is the what if act engine and all we discuss tomorrow class and then also if possible we start a live class okay guys thank you hope you like the video uh, please share and subscribe for more videos related to the msbi guys okay thank you msbi and power bi and sql server thank you so much